This topic is called factoring out a constant before factoring a quadratic. And factor completely is the only direction given to us. So if you notice, if you look at all three of these terms, they're all divisible by 5. So that's what it means by factoring out a constant. We're going to factor that 5 out, so we're left with just y squared. And then if you divide by 5, you're left with 8y. And if you divide by 5, you're left with minus 10. Now at this point, I want to just look at the a times c. a is 1 in this case. So I need to find something that multiplies up to negative 10 and adds up to negative 8 at exactly the same time. So this would be negative 10, or I'm sorry, this would, um, is that possible? So 2 and 5 would not work, 1 and 10 would not work, so this is not, it's done. So our answer, we would just simply type in 5 and then y squared minus 8y minus 10. Now if you could go further, then go ahead and go further. It is possible that you can go any further, but if it cannot be factored, then you just leave it like it is. I hope this helps. Good luck with this topic.